you all know we are with Tracy. We feel like we live here. <laughs> we're moving in, and she doesn't know it. We're secretly moving in. We're secreting her. We're going to become part of the empire. Just she doesn't know about it yet. But um, she is. Real, do we say dropping? That's what they all say. Dropping. Drop She's dropping a new clothing line. Uh, April 9th, right? It's actually, it's April 10th, but lo and behold, the shopping channel told me it's actually launching at on Jeannie Becker's show April 7th. Oh, oh, so you can start doing the online exclusive. ordering on April 7th, Three days but after. I will be on the shopping channel hawking my wares on the 10th. So I approached them uh, two years ago, mm -hmm. and I said, you're clothing me every day, and every every day, you know, people want to know about the clothing. And they were saying, "Oh, we're gonna put your face on a billboard on the side of Frida's, and we want to hand it to a shot of you every day." And I thought, you know what? We need to actually, we let's work together to see what we can do yeah. and collaborate to come up with something that we're we're all very proud of. But I, I want to actually own something. Yeah, yeah. I want to be a part of owning something. Good. You know, and, and it's a partnership, and a partnership yeah. goes both ways. Yeah. Right? That's right. And and they said. We love you and we respect you and we're really open to what you want to do. And I said, well, I, I work at a Rogers company yeah. and the, the shopping channel is a Rogers company. There we go. And the shopping channel had approached me a couple of times to rep other brands, mostly fitness wear. Mm -hmm. But I was sort of like, mm, I I feel like I'm, I trust myself a lot more now to to say this feels right and this doesn't yes. feel right. Yes. And I kind of felt like I don't want to rep another brand because I'm usually about keeping it real. Right. So I want to be able to tell people like this comes from me. Yeah. And if it's just I'm repping another yoga company, it doesn't really feel No, right. it's not authentic. Right. So Frida's stuff. was kind of like, well, you know, I'm not sure about being, we're, we are a big brand. I don't know if we want to be sold by the shopping channel because it might dilute our brand, which mm -hmm. I understood. They're very yeah. respecting the fashion industry. Mm -hmm. Then, after the two designers, Sam and Elaine, who worked for Frida's, created this and we came up with the concept and everything, they were like, oh, no, 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 put our name on the label. Oh, amazing. Because it's okay. good quality items that we can all stand behind. How I'm not embarrassed at all about any item in the line I wear no at all. No way. I mean, I cannot, like, they all look so beautiful. I was just going through them and I was like, I want that. I say that, that, that up, end, like, up close, um, the material and the structure are so it's amazing. It's quality. Yeah. Right? It's not cheapy cheap. I oh, mean, no. Did I just see stretch? Yes. And I see and a like butt stretch. cover. Oh, and stretch. Yes. And your butt cover is my butt and my covering thighs. Yes. Right? I mean, Not that there's anything wrong, but no. sometimes no. I have to you feel comfortable if you've just got a little bit of coverage going on. I have to say, I read your, uh, if you don't know, in um, Tracy's in Instagram, you have to go to it because hey it is, well, I, I feel like A, I relate, we relate to you as people, yes. and two, I feel like there's two people in this world. Hmm. One who's one. a hustler, and right. I feel like you are a hustler, and we get ourselves in situations that we're often <laughs> overstretched. But we're never going to change that, even though we say it's we're too not. much and it keeps going. So today I was like, that's why we love you and aspire to be like you, because you're like, we'll always figure it out. You'll get right. yourself in that situation, and then you get all sad and like, oh, uh, like, the I world was is sad last night, and I got, I felt like I was just beating myself up, yeah. like I'm not doing it right, and I'm failing, and this kid is probably going to fail great too, because me. <laughs> And that kid is throwing up, I wasn't here. Yes, yes, yeah, like, yes. why wasn't I here? Oh, there's dishes in the sink. Oh, you need lunch tomorrow? So do I. Like, at every grocery lunch. Like, where's the food? Where's right? the food, yeah, right? Like, everything was closed. Let's have some more cheese strings. Oh, the deli meat's gonna kill you because there's nitrates in it because it's in your sandwich. That's all Let's I have got. more. Let's have more. But yeah, it just felt like I felt like I was failing. And I get that every once in a while. It's cyclical and it's because there's too much on my plate and it's always gonna be that way. It will you're always, so you're not, oh, you're not looking to escape. That. No, because it makes me, it, it makes, keeps me going, going it, it makes me happy. happy, it's just sometimes it gets to be too Is much. it also and because it's the cry. launch is coming of your clothing line, so it's like, not only are you There's launching it, but it's a lot of pressure, and you know, for us, we have um, two of us, so when we take a risk, it's kind of like we are together. So if right. we fail or if we don't, like, you know, the success is together and the failure is together, right. and when someone says no, it's together. I feel, I feel good because I feel like I've pushed myself in ways that I haven't pushed myself before, and I think you two can understand this. You get yourself in these situations, like I'll always read on your account, oh my gosh, we did a meeting with these people and it was like, oh my god, like yeah. I didn't think you'd be doing Never. meetings yes. with these people. Yeah. But you Never. did it. This. And then you it boosts your confidence. Yes. It tells you something about yourself. So you true. learn something more about yourself. You're like, oh I can do it, I can meet these people. And I feel like 
I can do it. I can have my name in uh, in clothing, yeah. and I can come up with a marketing plan, and I can send out emails, and I can I can tell people why they should buy it. I can do it. I've been in all these new circumstances, and I don't know if it's wrong or right, but I know I'm doing it. Yeah. yeah. And for me, that is it's very it boosts the confidence. Totally, absolutely. You feel so inspired after you push yourself yeah. one little step. But it sounds like from behind the scenes, you have a lot of support from your husband and your mom, which we have as well, which makes it easier. And you, and you probably feel like that's your team. That's your team. We I all do. Get together. They're my team. And you know, last night the reason why I was out of my house for 12 hours because I was with the two Frida's women mm -hmm. who are young and oh. creative, and also one who's a Capricorn like me. She doesn't sit. She doesn't stop at anything. Got it. Like yeah, to the point where she's so detail oriented. Sometimes we have to be like slap, slap, like yeah, move shake on. it off. Like, get it. Let's get. Let's go. She's so on top of things. I was with them planning out four hours of television for the shopping channel, putting piece anything. by piece together, and we were all just going for it. Sam had a migraine. I'm thinking my kid's sick. Elaine's trying to plan a wedding and we're all just there slugging through, getting through uh, it. So I feel like they're my team that's too. That's You've got that's really and they take it, they take it as well and we all take the losses and we'll all swear together and then we're yeah. like, okay, let's figure this out now. I feel like also you uh, have done a lot of the clothing yourself. Like it's not yeah, like, like I didn't design it, but I know it so intimately because it's designed based on my life. Yes, you did it for crazy. moms. So, you want to go out to brunch together with the girls and look kind of chic? I've got that stuff. You want to look professional that. at work? I've got that. You want to be all like cool rapper mommy? I've got that. Like, like when we go to the club at nighttime? <laughs> yeah, right. She does. It's the <laughs> And I'm like, when night, we will be out, oh, yes. and we will go to a club. We and were, we, were, we were cocktailing just a she, few nights ago, and we said, wish that Tracy was here. So we, we could go club to we, we were going to go, we, were, we wouldn't know a club to go to, but she could tell us. Yeah, it's hard. I have to seek them out. Like, there are people like... Um, not 18. Who aren't underage. And there they're, are they're not going to look at me like I'm the old lady. There no, are there places. places. Because okay. I was such a hardcore oh. party girl for a big chunk of my Fire. life. Oh. Okay, so I'm <laughs> We said, so yeah, so that me. group has grown up. Maybe yeah. 30. And some of no. them are still partying. Still and some party. of them are still DJing. And some of them are still promoting See, parties. So I only go to their parties. Okay. Okay. And they're well, not every weekend. There's an underground that we need to find. She knows the bet. There's like a door you knock on and you get in. Well, I was looking for a female DJ. And I was like, I think Tracy knows <laughs> I know. somebody. She told at me who to look for. Yeah. What is the price point of the clothes? Are they like I'm thinking I need a whole brand new wardrobe. Can I afford it? Uh, <laughs> well, the range is 90 to 395. Okay. So yeah. it is not a cheap line. And the reason why it's not a cheap line is because it is made in Canada. Right, right, right. I didn't want it in Bangladesh. I didn't want it in no. Bangalore. I didn't want it in China. I right. wanted it made in Canada. I wanted to know the quality of the goods. We wanted to know the manufacturing was being done right here in Toronto. Yes. Um, and we're we're proud of that. Who's your mentor? Um, Who's the woman? My because mom is pretty cool. Okay. Yeah. So my mom, what's cool about her, she reminds me of my daughter as well. Oh. She is a very hard worker. They're they're very, uh, you know, they both worked over 30 years at their jobs. My mom at Toronto General Hospital, my dad as an engineer for Weston's Bakery. But my mom has a joy of fun. My mom. Joie de vie? A joie de vie. That je ne sais quoi. She she likes to live. She likes to have fun. She likes to party. She likes to drink. My mother at 75. Like I like hanging out with my mom because she can she can say you're stressing yourself out. When your mental health goes, it's very difficult to face it. So yes, chill. Oh, but then she can also say, oh, you two have a wedding in the Bahamas and an exclusive island, and you don't know what to do with the kids. You need to go. I and if you don't have that. any money, find the money. Take out a line of credit. You only live once. Go. You're very <laughs> open about post baby, post baby having a hard time. Oh. And what did your mom do? Like what? Because she how did. I'll be honest with you, I wasn't that open with my mom about it when I had a hard time with my first. Mm -hmm. And even though she is my support system, I sort of felt like because they have done so much with their life, yeah. and they have, you know, they came to a strange country and started from scratch with no car and worked their way up, I almost felt like I didn't have the right to complain mm -hmm. to my parents. Mm -hmm. That's pretty sad, and that's why I always say, talk about it. Yeah. Yeah. I should have complained to my parents, but it was all Leo, it was all my husband. He was the one chopping up the food, trying to feed me. He was the one calling my girlfriends, like, Tamara, you gotta help her. I don't know what to do anymore. Like, yeah. I'm scared. So, How did you get out of it? I did talk to a friend, um, and this is my girlfriend, Tamara, and I said, my sister didn't even tell me it was gonna be rough. Like, no, no yeah. one told me. Although maybe she, maybe it wasn't as rough for her. It wasn't. Right. So she, um, I talked to Tamara, and I said, I'm having a really hard time, 
and um, I don't know why this is so hard and I feel all alone. Uh -huh. And Leo want me to talk to you and I don't even know what to say at yes, this moment. Yes. And she said, it is hard. And I go, what? And she said, it is hard. It's very hard. And I said, well, why didn't you tell me that? And I just burst out crying. Yeah. 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 Like, why didn't you tell me it was hard? No one said it was going to be hard. Like, nobody. And um, she said, it's hard. There are days when you just feel like, I'm not sure why I did this. It's, right? Yeah. You know, like, it's, it's, um, it, it, it's the most joy and the most sort of, you know, terrifying hell you'll ever be yeah. in. It's both sides of the spectrum. And that was the beginning for me. And so yeah. after that, I came up with an action plan. Yeah. I was not going to be alone with that baby. Yeah. I scheduled a friend or a family member every single day Guard to come visit exactly me. What you need. And I got out the house no matter what. I had my little bugaboo stroller. It was not a running stroller. I would no. jog with it. Yeah, we did too. Yeah. And we yeah. would yeah. lock the wheels yeah. and yeah. go like this. Yeah. We would lock them the gut. This we yeah, got, we got to, it. And fine. the baby's like, this. So we, <laughs> even if it was 10 minutes, we're like, we can do it, we can, we can do, do it. We can do it, we can do it. Like, just a little job, like something to get my serotonin going, like anything. Oh I went to Starbucks every day. That Me was too. My Same date. with Sam yes. Every day. Yeah. Every day. With the baby. It was like a religion. Yeah. It was it's a like, religion. we looked forward I to it. It I was like, for it yes, we would look, we'd wake up and be like, okay, we got it. We can do this. We can do this. I just yeah. need to get to my tall, non fat, no with mocha. Oh my gosh. And it's all good. The first part of when you were talking about how hard it was made me feel like crying. And then when you said in some days, I just feel like, why did I do this? And it made me feel like laughing because yesterday I said to my mom and my husband, the kids were all over the place. I'm like, it's been seven years. Is it not time for them to move out? <laughs> like, I've been doing this for seven years. Like, get, get out of here. I'm like, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I've been doing both. this. We were both done. Yesterday was a done day. We were both like, this is just, you're, you pushed me. I'm gone. I'm like, where's the TV for a few hours? Oh, bedtime, was, bedtime was 6.15. I'm like, everyone up. I don't care what you do in there. Good night. My mom was laughing. She's like, Mark, listen. To what now they say, I'm like, I'm done with it. Seven years, it was so much fun. <laughs> no, it was, was great. It was I so fun. fun. So um, I, we've said this before, but so many women look at you and they say you have it all, right? Right. Like, you're doing it Which all. Which I'm always reminding people I don't. You, but you do a lot. I do a lot. I do a lot. I you do. do a lot. I'm just, I'm not always, like I like yesterday broke me. Okay. And so there are days like that. I would say mostly I'm happy though, because I like having the full plate. I'm usually good about claiming my flaws. Like I said, at the end of this show, I feel like I left the women hanging a little bit at the oh, end. Okay. So you know. So yeah. I said to the senior director, I, I go, I loved the show. I loved the lineup. It's gone yeah. through a lot of, it's gone through an evolution. I like the youth of it now. And I said, I felt like I left those ladies hanging for too long. I'm not going to do that next time. I'm yeah. going to bring them in. And she goes, I agree with you. But she said, I also feel like I did this wrong. I always come we up with it first as yeah. a leader. Yes. I will always say, oh, I feel like I could work on that. Or I'll be like, I was kind of off today. I yeah. yes. couldn't talk. Good. So I'm really good about owning it. I don't mind admitting I'm wrong. No. I don't think I'm not supposed to be wrong. And I know I'm always going to screw up. Yeah. But yeah. even with this, you were able to do it at the clothing line. Yeah. Uh, like that's a little harder for me so when I showed it on City Line there's a couple of people on the staff I really respect and I was waiting to see what they yeah. were say yeah. and it meant a lot to me yes. and you know when one of them was like you know what I this stuff yeah. <laughs> you know like that's a big deal yes because yeah. yes. my, my husband's a tough cookie like that he yeah. doesn't just give out compliments right so if he gives you an inch it's sort of like oh, Thank you. Yeah, he really means That's it. Nice. That's good. He doesn't just throw them out. Yeah. So um, that meant a lot to me. Will you ever be doing accessories and shoes? <gasps> Listen, I've thought about a couple of things. Like I'm just launched. throwing it all out there. Yeah. Um, people have been like, "Why aren't you doing fitness apparel?" Mm -hmm. People have said, "Are you thinking maybe children's clothes? Mm -hmm. Are you thinking maybe shoes?" So all three of these things keep coming keep coming up yes. and I'm thinking about them but I feel like I trust Frida's because Frida's okay. has been making clothes for, yeah. for decades. I need fitness gear. I'm like, I stink. Yeah. I don't know. I you today. Babies, my hormonal thing yeah. is like out of whack. Yeah. Like my husband's like, you didn't used to smell like that. Remember, <laughs> <laughs> it was just all like, yeah, you know, good so like roses. Yeah. 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 What happened to that? Yeah. 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 And it's like, you knocked me up twice, and now my hormones are crazy. Yeah. And now I'm hot. I yeah. used to be hot. So oh, hot. It's always hot. hot. It's always with the hot. So yeah. I need clothes. I need clothes that's going to work. I need fitness clothes that you're going to wash, and mm -hmm. after seven washes, it's not gonna smell like bum. <laughs> yeah. I need and and then for the kids' clothes, it's like I don't have any experience with that. Nor does your kids are going to dress though. They always look pulled together. Do you think together. so? Because I oh, feel whatever. like I dress them like all your family cousins. selfies. You guys are all pulled together. So your husband's so always family. on point. He's like, so stylish. You guys you dress up to get up. I mean, you see us on the you see yeah. us on the weekend. You are watching. Dress well though. Oh. 
I feel like you guys uh, dress in like urban chic. Okay, if you call you're, like hoodies and like I can't wait to roll out and throw on my jeans. Oh, what's nice about you and your husband? You're, 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 I feel like your face is laying in a smile. <laughs> you seem like happy people. Well, yeah, we're pretty happy. I'm yeah. happier than he is. Really? He looks yes. so happy. He comes across I'm very like, happy. Everyone thinks that. I'm yeah. like, you guys don't know him. He's happy. <laughs> But Joe, I know the like feeling. Five-year-old, and he's oh, forty-two. Right, right. Some of those too. Like, yeah. They're cranky. Yeah. Let's call the fun police sometimes. We're like, here's the fun police. I, they I, I say he's got a fun meter. Fun police, yeah, yeah. He's nope. got a fun meter. So yeah. when you go to parties, I'm like, ba 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 ba. Is the meter going off? Because I know I'm getting drunk and having a good time. Does that mean it's time to go home, old man? <laughs> <laughs> like, no, I wasn't going to say that. I'm like, yes, you were. You want to go home? Do you have like goals for a year from now where you want to see the clothing line being? What would be success? Right, okay, so they bought a spring line and a fall line. Okay, so we're good for 2016. Okay, let's see if they buy a 2017. No, 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 okay. they, no, no, when they buy a 2017. That's what I'm thinking, That's girl. what we do. You never say and if, it's always when. A bigger, they buy yes. more. Because what we sold them initially, um, they said, you're just launching and this is ambitious, let's bring it down a notch. Okay, like, okay. Yeah. So we split it up over two seasons. Mm -hmm. So 2017, I want them to buy the whole kit and caboodle yes. and like even better fabrics and better patterns mm -hmm. and like just really good quality stuff and we've learned a lot about yes. the amount of lessons we've learned yeah. we're going to put all of that into practice. After April 7th, 9th, 10th, yeah. there seems to be three dates but April 7th <laughs> is the big one, yes. right? Yes. They can find it on like... Um, Go to the shoppingchannel.com if they're not live on the website like, everywhere in Canada. Like if you're in Red Deer, Alberta... You can get it. You can get it. Or if you're in Prince George, you can get it. Size two to twenty people. Size two She's to twenty. To us all. And, and if you're getting the pants, go a size up. Believe okay. it or not, these are twelve. Okay. 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 These are size That's twelve. So, good. so why? Because they're they're you're slim. They, they're She's not. So they're very. Um, there was a lot of shrinkage in the pants. Okay. okay. Whereas the tops, I'm a small in everything. You are. Yeah. In the tops. Yeah. So take my body as an example. So firm. Like, where's the jiggle? Like, we were talking yeah, about where's the jiggle. I'm really like, no, I don't know. For you. I guess if you want to. Well, that will be at the that. club. We'll be doing that Facebook Live one night, everybody. That's right. Um, Tracy, it is like always such an honor, such a. Um, we're, long, we're long lost best friends. I know. I know. No, you two are absolutely Thanks. awesome. I just, I love watching your empire being built. Brick. By brick. Girl, you're on the right Let me tell you, we're it. gonna take over Canada. We're not North America. Not North America. Yeah, yeah, go worldwide. Wrapping this up? Yeah, we'll wrap it up. Yeah. Wrap it up. <laughs> wrap it up. We all have sick babies at home. I know. Time to <laughs> Tune into the shopping channel on April 7th to see Jeannie Becker uh, like kill it for Tracy Moore. We know what's gonna happen, right? <laughs> you can find Tracy at Tracy Moore on no, you're at Tracy City Line. At Tracy City at Line. Tracy City Line. Yeah, I'm at Tracy City Line on Snapchat. I'm at Tracy City Line. On She's Instagram. gonna get a I'm YouTube and she doesn't Line know yet. We're really you can't critique your shopping channel. We gotta talk to YouTube. Yeah. Gotta All you need to do is take your picture. Serious Do you know how much fun you would they would have at the shopping channel with your camera? I know. I'll talk to you about that.